sort of handkerchief, voluminous brass behind and vulva, but it's also coated in blue and white sugar. So some people have been reading it as the sort of whitewashing and sugar coating of American history because there aren't very many social studies textbooks, if any, that actually really substantively deal with America's sort of slave past. It's sort of just completely glossed off or just thought of as, oh, you know, they liked it. That was like that thing that was fun. Um, of course they just wanted to because, you know, the Sphinx as sort of a myth is this powerful figure where you, you know, you get a riddle and you answer the, the riddle incorrectly, you will be destroyed. So what does it mean to have these otherwise very degraded, stereotypical images of black women embedded within this powerful figure worthy of sort of law and sort of mystery and power? You know, people who are continuing to be complicit in the sort of subjugation of black women's bodies over time and sort of exploiting bodies and labor for their own sort of benefit and all a white woman came up to us and she was like, why did you stop him? He was entertaining us. And I'm thinking, oh, I can't do this today. Probably not tomorrow either. But, you, know, so that's you know what I find interesting? That she chose not, there's nothing in, like some people come in and you just get it right yeah. away. Mm -hmm. And there's clearly some people come in and they don't. Mm -hmm. And they're posing with their bags and whatever yeah. they're doing. And yes. have anything in writing mm -hmm. to make it totally, like, so you get it, you don't get it. Mm -hmm. That's kind of yeah. what... Just, there's so much sort of complexity and layer and nuance and sort of um, a deep sense of pain when one comes to consciousness about, well, what were the costs of sort of the privilege you occupy? And that sort of work takes a lot of mental effort to sort of right. engage in that sort of like transformative, reflective, internal thought process. Yeah. That's heavy stuff. Yeah. And it's very, very hard work, so... Yeah. Wow. <laughs>